Hey, hello, how you doing? I'm good, how are you doing? I'm great, I'm great. Now there are so many musical geniuses out there. What separates David? Well, I think David has a, a unique approach to everything that he does, you know. He's brilliant, but he's also, I would say in a way, um, as a young songwriter, uninhibited. I don't think David ever felt constrained to, to write a song that was simple and standard in the way that so many pop songs were. So you listen to his repertoire, particularly as a musician, it's very impressive, it's very compelling, it's very innovative. And then as a producer, the same. You know, David applies certain sounds, certain principles as a producer that have really, and, and in all cases, paying great attention to the artist involved. So it's not just about a David Foster song or production, it's how do you bring the, the best out of that artist. And for all those reasons, we're so pleased we can honor him tonight. That's awesome. Now, I heard the Grammys is going to be in New York this year. That's true. After 15 years, what, 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 what gives? <laughs> well, we used to, uh, before the past 15 years, bounce back and forth every so often. Um, we kind of put a lot of that on hiatus because we had a recession in this country and it's way more expensive in New York, there are the weather issues. Um, but the fact is we have a 60th anniversary. Uh, I am a New Yorker originally and my first show for at the Academy was in New York. So there are a lot of reasons to try to get back there, not the least of which is half our membership of, in the Academy, we're a membership organization. Our, east of the Mississippi. A uh, great portion of the music industry is based on the East Coast. New York iconic as could be, and we're just gonna mix it up a little bit.